hands concealing what deep down I felt for you. Oh, I regret for losing the one who loved me, for who I can't go back to. Walking through all the dust, memories and frame a past. Good day. How you going? So. Zane and I decided this afternoon to come up to the river, come up for a bit of a look. Basically what this is about is I've done some of the lower stretches of the river, they're pretty tight and you've got to work your way through it. And this is the next stretch of the river that I want to try to attempt to do it. It's probably about 8 k's worth of river here. Google Maps is pretty inconclusive whether it's river or whether it's doable or not due to the tree canopy as everyone can see there. So we've launched our kayak, oh I've got the stand up paddle board, Zane's got his kayak, we've launched it downstream a bit, we've come upstream maybe a couple of hundred metres and we've already run into our first blockage um, of trees and so forth. So we're just going to have a bit of a walk and see if we can get past it and see how much further up we have to go if we have to carry these boards around it and see if we can get back into the water a little bit further up and carry on a bit further upstream. So, there's a bit of a blockage, as you can see here. We've walked our way around it, maybe 50 metres, and it seems like there's a bit of clear water up ahead. So we're going to keep, keep on trekking on and see how we go. Um, it's already become a bit of a problem, I've realised, with the stand-up paddleboard. It's got a fin. Uh, fins don't work so well in this shallow water. Zane's kayak's just gliding over the top. The paddleboard's hooking up a little bit on the bottom, so you've got to keep your eyes open. But the water's nice and clear, and I can see most of the problems before I get to them. So I don't know, we'll keep going, see how far up we can get. You ready, Zane? Yeah. This is looking more and more. More and more like the stand up paddle boards, probably not the craft of this job here. <laughs> All right, well, we didn't get very far, and we've come to another blockage. Uh, this one could be interesting. See what I can do here. It's the old up and over for me. Zane's going to deal with it. Should be able to get around this one okay. Luckily did that without falling in the water. Put the paddle down in your kayak. Yeah. Grab the log. And push yourself through. Are you gonna try it that way? Yeah. Now put your foot down. Put your foot down. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, you've got that. Easy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah boy. That's how we do it. Boom. Alright, right, next obstacle. See if you can get through this one. Easy. Yeah, I just want to see how much further along here we have to go. 
Yeah. We can get around a bit further, that's okay. Go on. <laughs> so our kayak trek has turned into a bit of a walking trek at the moment. <laughs> some like really sandy patches which were like we could hardly even get through with the paddleboard and the kayaks. See ya. River. If you can call it a river, more like a creek. Running through just big roadblocks like this. Uh, yeah. Pretty much impassable on canoe, kayak, I don't think it really matters what it is. There's always plenty of room to walk up and around the outside on the banks and drag around and portage but at the moment I'm wearing thongs and shorts and this is prime habitat for tiger snakes and there is a lot of them around here so I don't really want to push it at this time of the year in the summer when they're active. Come the winter time when the water levels are up a bit it might be a different story so we'll come back and have a look in the winter and see if it's passable then. But, well, you know, we had a crack. It's a Sunday afternoon, got nothing better to do with our time, so we thought we'd come and have a look anyway. <laughs> well done. You're cheating, aren't you? You're cheating. He almost went in for the drink. <laughs> You! shot. Uh, we weren't so successful today but we only had a couple of hours. It's going to be dark soon so we didn't really have a huge amount of time to go further. Like I said I wouldn't mind some boots and some shoes and long pants if we're going to try it again. But we're going to have another shot at it next time Zane. Mm -hmm. If you like following our adventures hit the subscribe button and stay tuned and see what we get up to next time. And don't forget to smash that like button. <laughs>